dingy, dodgy street. Look at all the trash everywhere. Why is there so much trash? I didn't mean to, understand? I didn't mean to. Sure. And that guy... Oh, jeez. Someone just booted up the sun. The blinding sun is now turned on. He gives the great tips without giving away spoilers. <laughs> now let's do some kind of dodgy date together with Johnny. Yeah, action punch. Super fit for an 80 something year old. Good morning, high city, a day in the light. I was on my own, catching a ride. Now, let's go and catch up with Lizzy Wizzy. Chrome girl whose manager is in a relationship with and who he wants to make a, an engram software backup of her personality without her consent it would seem how far away are we going oh not too far that's the best way to get there is it this way or should i be up above Tell me, let's just run down the road. It's faster than summoning the bike and crashing into stuff. <laughs> oh, this is a quiet, dingy, dodgy street. Look at the trash everywhere. Why is there so much trash? Anyway, back in the hotel. Up the stairs. In the room. Save the game. All right, Lizzie, what's going on? Lizzie, what in the fuck? Oh dear. Now I get the rush. V, I, I, I was angry. I, I, I pushed him. These fucking arms. These hands. You ever wake up in the middle of the night and not know who you were for a second? Or, I mean, you ever feel like you weren't really you? Mm. I, that's how I feel all the time. Every moment. This emptiness, this helplessness. I stopped seeing, creating. Just now, I, I, I just wanted to break up with him, you know? Tell him I wanted him out of my life. But I, I don't even know how, when, I, I... Well, that sounds like a case of cyber psychosis kicking in. So Liam really did have a reason to be afraid of you. I didn't mean to, understand? I didn't mean to! Sure, maybe. All the same to him, though. So this is about the body, right? That's why you called? Yes, I... The media can't hear about this, got it? That would be... Oh. Huh? The world would eat it up. A tale of the temptation to control another's memory. A grim reminder that a person is merely a collection of bites that can be copied, reproduced, copied, reproduced. Lizzie, snap the fuck out of it. What about the body? I don't know. Do whatever. Take it somewhere, burn it. I'll pay you. Oh man, I don't know about that. He needs to get help. Nope, not doing it. Something... Something's not right, Lizzie. No, quite the contrary. Everything's finally falling into place. Go, V, and shut the door. <laughs> My job failed because we rejected it. <laughs> I want to see what happens next. Wounds not self inflicted. Yeah, I reckon she's definitely got cyber psychosis. I have nothing more to say to you. Well, I want to see how that unfolds, if there is any more to unfold, I guess. 
Well, let's do that again then. Up the body. Maybe it's all over. Maybe she goes more psychotic. I'll have to wait and see. Lizzie, what in the... Fuck. V, I... You ever... So Liam really did have a reason to be afraid of you. Oh, he's facing the other way this time. I didn't mean to, understand? <laughs> I didn't mean to! Sure, me. So this is about the body. Yes, I... Huh? The world would eat it up. A tale of the temptation to control another's memory. A grim reminder that... Lizzie, snap the... I don't know. Do whatever. Okay. Take it somewhere. Take care burn it. it. I'll pay Sleep you. Sleep soundly now. Sleep? I won't sleep. I don't need to. Thank you, Liam. You don't realize it, but you've given me something beautiful. The hell are you talking about? Go, V. Go. And take him with you. Okay. Someone... someone should give you a checkup. See if you're okay, Lizzie. Someone you trust? I like what's happening to me. Lovely to meet you, V. Now go, go. Definitely the tale, telltale signs of cyberpsychosis. Like people lose touch with all the things that used to inspire them or give them pleasure. And then they feel disconnected like they're separate to um, everyone else. And then they have no regard for life. I don't know, I read that on one of the data chips somewhere. Alright, well that's done then. He needs checking up on. And that guy... Oh, jeez. Someone just booted up the sun. The blinding sun is now turned on. Um... Honestly, that guy probably deserved better than that. He wasn't the one who tried to get her converted to Chrome in the first place either. I want to see if anything more happens, but it's possible nothing does. <sighs> no worries, David. Have fun. Stay safe. Cool. Let's now catch up with Rogue. So, Johnny... Uh, wants to go on a bit of a date with Rogue. Um, hopefully he is not as disruptive with our body this time. Let's see. V. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking? Or is it you? Johnny? You're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Go pick up Rogue at the afterlife in the evening. I've got to tell you, swing by in the evening. Got other things on my plate right now. Okay, this evening then. I'll be there. Till then. That's also not far away. Go for a little jog. And then we're probably going to have to sit and wait and pass the time because it's probably early morning at the moment. Lizzy Wizzy, thank you. I received a transfer. Okay. Worried about you. Nothing else. Nothing else. Oh, yes. Good tip, Danny. Pick her up in Johnny's car, of course. I didn't even think of that. Hells yeah, that's what we're doing. All right, so it needs to be in the evening. What time is it? It's morning time. All right, so let's skip time. Bye. 
Uh, 10 hours. Oh, sorry, I meant 11 hours. Cool. Summon the car. Yes, the 911. Dude. Okay, bye. One day we'll have cars that can do this in real life. Well, they won't. They won't spawn as this as quickly as this. Uh, Dabbit, you haven't missed anything interesting yet. We're just making our way to um, go on a date with Rogue, or so that Johnny can possess us to go on a date with Rogue. Ah, oh, there's cars in the way. Oh no. <laughs> I'm trapped. We're so close, <laughs> but we're stuck in traffic. Alright, here we go. I don't want to scratch up the Porsche right before going on a date. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look different. <laughs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm the third time around. Have to get out? Looks like I've got to get out, do I? It, Danny is like uh, the supreme advisor. He gives the great tips without giving away spoilers. <laughs> hey, Rogue. Ready? Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? You look... Wow. That Johnny's wild? Or yours? When's he gonna show? I'm just your driver. See, you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This... Johnny's Porsche? <laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. The one Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Yeah. So Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Dragons went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a day. Thought so too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there a million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up our Osaka HQ. Yeah, well, I reckon uh, he's bang on about drive ins. Not right. quite as big now. Tell me what's going on. For real. Meaning... Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. Right. Well, we'll see. Wonder if I had worn Johnny's jacket with a... I really should have played the piece wearing his jacket. I've got his gun equipped. <laughs> oh, just taking it all in. <laughs> a selfless Johnny Silverhand. Apparently you're a positive influence on him. I reckon we are a positive influence on him. We can change him. Since he's been changing us anyway. Got to meet somewhere in the middle, right? Especially if we got to share a body, share a mind, share a psyche if we don't sort this out. Right, so far I haven't crashed, so that's also a bonus, right? He says as he nearly crashes. <laughs> oh, that's right, we're going up the top of the hill. Build the pixel draw. Oh, come on. Ah, 
I'm ruining the romantic drive by being all over the joint. Oh man. I get that I'm not the best driver, but I'm not this bad at driving games. Danny, Davit, <laughs> Grizz, how have you found the cars to be? So I still swerve. Here we are. Yeah, she's not worried by the dodgy driving. <laughs> ah, not PC, Said Gamer. PC for the win. <laughs> I don't believe it. it really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right, do your thing. I'll watch. Okay. Wham, bam, shut Gotta be the past then. All right, let's go. Guess we really are. Well done. Okay, just so everyone's aware, I was able to bust in so quickly right now because I've explored this place before when I was just in between streams and running a running a muck. I found the code to open the door. I went out into the cinema area. Yeah, a couple of hundred hours of driving. Yep, that'll do it. Oh, hey, Saeed, you're Iranian. Awesome. Oh, I've had a mix of everyone tonight. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Sure thing. Oh, look at this for a Let's fancy get up. The projector. And I've been up in the projector room as well. Might have even been a legendary up there. Maybe the not. Is over here. I don't think there was. Georgia. We've okay, had Mexico. Found the projector. Australia. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and running. Ran. I will figure it out, Johnny. Don't you worry. Search the storage area. Bushido, Fade to Black. So that's a movie? Alright, so I'm guessing the storage area is down here somewhere? No. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. There we go. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. Okay. Ah, Saeed. Well, that's good. I don't know much about Iran. And Danny's from UK. We really have got everyone. This is a good mix. Glad to have everyone here together. Now, let's do some kind of dodgy date together with Johnny. Have fun, you crazy kids. All right. Let's submit. Loop. Bottoms up. Definitely helps, Grizz. Grabbed us the best spots. Hop on up. Yeah, action punch. Oh, that finished quick. Oh no, still going. Okay. This is from the Matrix. <laughs> oh, so that's how you do it, Rogue. I don't need this world anymore, but I need you. Johnny, I was wrong about you, and it's a crying shame. This is how you imagine this evening going? Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. I'm just in Fury 77. <laughs> We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. But I like 2077, Rogue. A far inferior version. 
Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? I do everything in my power not to lose you. Johnny, I... Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing. It's just... I had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. We're going, Raymance. Don't worry, Grizz. We're a smooth talker. Front of the action movie. It's like Adam, it's like Johnny fighting Adam Smasher, right? Oh no, lost an arm. Oh, rough. Does that mean it? Is that game over? Or is he gonna grow a new one now? What happens? I kind of want to see what happens in the movie. Oh, hang on. What's it? Oh, sh he's got back up. And scene cut. Blew him up. Wow. There is some faint audio. Anyway. Sure, that's it. Nothing about Grayson or Smasher. What? What's Smasher got to do with anything? Getting the sense you still got a thorn in your side there. Because I do. I'm irate, disappointed, but rather not think about it now. choices I think you might be hiding something from me Johnny there's a heap of things I'm hiding from you but all we got's this one night it's more than I ever could have asked for rogue I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body, but I'm here. <laughs> All right, came on. Oh, into the back seat. Super fit for an eighty something year old. to you tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed to pretend I'm the same rogue you knew actually managed to fool myself for a little get back on my own rogue fuck so close but not quite All right, we're taking pills to bounce us back, I'm assuming. Hey. Virtual blue balls, yeah. Hey, Johnny held up his end this time. Rogue's gone. Yep. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. It was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. 
Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Gotta mull it over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. <laughs> Uh, but at the end of the movie, the guy got the girl. Uh, wow, yeah, definitely the uh, the hottest 80-something-year-old ever. But, uh, yeah, got pretty far there, but um, in the end, he wasn't quite into it. Cool, new job, holding on. Oh, well, that's what we're doing. So, oh, meet Johnny by the North Oak sign. The whole time I was flat on my digital ass in Mikoshi, Kerry was out there forging his glittery solo career. He'd better be fucking chill after all these years, right? But something tells me deep down, he's still the same. Anyway, come on, guy's gotta shit himself when he sees me. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, Sparkle Saws. Welcome back. Glad to have you on stream. And in the end, nothing else matters. It's a danger, pretty here in our city. 